will you grow? How will you grow? So you're now uh, looking at your growth strategy because you've managed to reduce debt. What are the three top priorities for your company? Good morning, Francine. Um, first of all, I would like to stress that all of our businesses uh, in the core have performed remarkably well in the second quarter. Um, results are up by uh, almost 25% uh, in, uh, in operating profit. And it just underlines that all of our businesses are not only strongly performing, but also have the prerequisites uh, uh, for future tangible growth. Um, and hence, we think actually about opportunities in all of those segments. Uh, most importantly, uh, we see growth opportunities um, in the energy networks uh, uh, area across Europe, where an increasing build out of renewables, increasing build out uh, of uh, e mobility, and increasing load on regional and local grid levels will provide for a lot of orga organic growth opportunities. So, just to mention one segment where we see tangible uh, opportunities uh, for stepping mm -hmm. up our investments. Um, but not only that, but also uh, leeway for increasing our dividend, as we um, um, announced today. But, but so I know you will update on a, a new growth and investment strategy. Can you give us at least a flavor of what you'll be focusing on in this new strategy update? Um, today is not about talking uh, about no specific numbers, uh, but uh, what I can tell you is that it will be focused predominantly on organic investments, um, and it will be focused on investments uh, in our existing core businesses. And, and next to networks is going to be the, the global renewables build out where we focus um, on, uh, on, on secure revenue streams, uh, for, uh, uh, you know, interesting pipelines uh, in the U.S., uh, across Europe, both onshore and offshore but also our customer solutions business, which focuses on the trend of increasing uh, uh, demand from our customers for decentral distributed energy generation. Um, so all of those fields will provide for, uh, for increased investment.